okay hey 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 what is up you guys um right now as you can see sj is not happy and my tongue is green because i have a matcha latte but um i think that's where all my energy is coming from because i got a burst of energy out of nowhere <clears throat> but this angle is so bad but anyway i mentioned in the last video that i had wanted to try to be consistent and record this specific video um this is not going as I wanted it to go. I had to wash my hair, blow dry my hair, do all that good stuff on my own because Sloan caught COVID. And um, me and Ashley are perfectly fine. It's just Sloan. So we're here at Walmart doing a pickup order, getting like medicine, all that good stuff. But these little braids is what I wanted to show y'all. I wanted to show I'm nowhere near done. I'm done the front part of my head. This is my very first time trying to install my own braids. The back is nowhere near done. So we're gonna cover that up and not to, try not to scare the people at Walmart, okay? But I wanted to show you guys, I want to bring y'all along for the journey of me doing my hair, um, braiding my hair for the first time. The back was supposed to be like really curly, full bundles, but those bundles won't get here until Tuesday. I would have gotten them today to put them in, but again, plans have changed. Um, so, because I don't want to wait until Tuesday, because I don't know when Salem is going to decide to come, what I'm going to do is just do the tribals in the front and um, individuals in the back. So, that's going to be that. And I just wanted to share that little tidbit before I forgot before yeah before i forgot to add anything into this video um also when i get in the house i'm not gonna do a try on haul with sj but i do want to show you guys the really cute stuff that i got him from shein which is so, they, everything is so freaking cute one of the things that i did get though it's not for him is this this is a tissue dispenser but i just put my face mask in it and keep it up there but I'm not going to say nothing else. I'm going to tend to my whiny baby. And, um, yeah, I will probably see y'all in, like, a day or two. If I'm talking super fast in this part of the video, it's because I am, because I want to hurry up and catch the sunlight before it disappears too, too much, which I think I'm going to open the curtains. All of the long sleeve stuff that looked like it don't belong in this season is because it doesn't. I got him fall stuff and all of the, um, all the fall stuff is in a size 100 euro which is like a two to three and all the stuff that looks like it belongs in this season i got in a 92 euro or a 90 euro which is right about where he is now this is the only thing that he's wore so far because one day it was like rainy or chilly or something so i wanted to put him in this but this fits really small this is a two and it fits super duper small and i got to he typically wears a 4t but because their stuff is cut big i decided to size them next i got him this father and son sweatshirt cute corduroy jacket if you see me keep looking to the side that's because i'm watching sj this cute corduroy jacket this is not a real pocket yeah no pockets it zips all the way down a dinosaur jacket like a little windbreaker because he loves dinosaur he can say dinosaur now i'll insert it dinosaur say dinosaur dinosaur good job yeah good job another cute little jacket that says smile which i think he might not be able to get into this one either 
I should have sized up a bit more but whatever SJ can't fit will go to Salem and has numbers six, two, two and three. A corduroy top. This one is a real pocket. Plaid jacket that SJ and Salem now have matching, which is so cute. Real pockets. Another hoodie that says Mama's Boy. Or sweater rather. This cute sweater, it's like a graphic sweater. I didn't notice I got him two corduroy shirts. Two cor another corduroy shirt. In a different color. I didn't get any pants because pants is like a year round thing, so they'll eventually come. That's all for the fall stuff. For the summer stuff. He has this cute little set. Stand up. Cute little set. Uh oh. Has little pockets. And here's the top. And it's like satiny. Which is really luxury like. This sh short and top set. It says NASA. This top that says I still live with my parents, which I gotta get him an ASAP because this is super small. So just three plain tees. This top that says me and mommy equals one broke daddy. This Joker outfit. A hat. And that's the last thing I'm going to show you because the other thing is in the car. I got him a cute little book bag. Um, I keep, I'm going to keep that in the car for like when we just need to throw his sippy cup in the bag and maybe a couple of pull-ups and some wipes and then go and get out the car. <laughs> I'm not going to, that's just going to be the travel book bag that have all his, good, his goodies in it, like his snacks and stuff. So that's what that's for. But yeah, this is the last thing. And per usual, I'll have everything... My little bun bun is all crooked. <laughs> per usual, I have everything linked in the description below. I'm not 100% sure if y'all will be able to hear me, but today is June the 1st, and oh my gosh, is today such a hot mess. It's such a hot mess. So I have now reached a point of pregnancy where I'm going to the doctors weekly and i go to the doctors today like normal me and sj we go to the doctor's appointment together he's been my role dog throughout this entire pregnancy pretty much and um i get there early too i usually get there right at the time that my, my appointment is but i get there early and they're like yeah well kids aren't allowed you didn't get the message and i'm like no i never i never got any text message i never got any email i never got any information stating that children aren't allowed it which is true i didn't i know y'all can't see me because of the the roof, sunroof is open but just listen to me just listen oh hold on wait maybe this will be better i need to get another car thingy like i had before but they like yeah kids aren't allowed so i'm like okay well is there another appointment that i can get today because I don't want to, I haven't missed an appointment yet, and I don't want to start missing any appointments, especially at the very end. Like, I feel like these are the most crucial appointments. And, um, so, I get an appointment for today at 1045. My appointment was at 840, my original appointment was at 845. I got another appointment for 1045, so I had to drive all the way back home. Mind you, this doctor's office is 30 minutes away from my house, so I drove 30 minutes there to stay in there for two minutes to go drive 30 minutes back then have to come back in the same direction to go to a new my new appointment and y'all oh this is so crazy literally so so crazy so crazy like my leg is tired from driving i'm tired of driving and i couldn't put my car in cruise control because it's been like a lot of traffic and I'm not the best with this car stuff, so I just know once I brake, then I gotta reset the cruise control or something like that. But I 
just found it safer to just drive regular and I'm tired. I'm T-I-E-D tired. Not even tired. I'm tired. I just had to come on here and come on here and vent a little bit about that. That's all I had to say. I will see y'all later when I get to the doctors or maybe not. I don't know. I'll see y'all and y'all will see me in the next clip. If today couldn't get any better, if you can't tell I'm red, I'm red because it's hot, it's boiling outside, literally, and my windows are down because the engine overheated in my car, and um, so I'm just sitting outside with my windows down in this area that I've never been in before. Like, it's not a bad area, it's a very nice area. It's not a bad area. Everything looks nice. It's clean. Um, I just left the doctors. Oh, update with the doctors. I am only a centimeter and a half. And my baby is due in less than two weeks. Um, but yeah, I'm not in a bad place. So I'm just waiting for the tow truck people to come to take me to the car dealership so that I can get the car looked at. And I'm just so happy I didn't put eyebrows and stuff on because these them bad boys would have been all over the place today. And I'm happy I got something so cool on. I'm happy that SJ is home um, with his yaya. I am just like I'm not happy because I don't want to be in this situation in the heat. But at the same time, I'm it could be a lot worse. So I'm just happy that things played out the way that they did play out. Like sj had to go home and all that other stuff like god works in mysterious ways and that's this is just one of those mysterious ways there's a reason why sj was not allowed at the doctors this time i and it was crazy because you seen i was just fussing like he'd been my ride or die with these doctor's appointments and here we are today just ran like he was with me last week and i go every week now so he was just with me last week and this week he can't go but there's no rise in covid but God works in mysterious ways, so all I can do is praise him and thank him. So, yeah, I just wanted to give y'all an update real quick. Um, they got a nail salon over here, so I'm going to see if I can get my nail fixed. Because, look at that, it started chipping. This ain't the, this is not the nail salon that I went to, but I'm going to see if they have this color or a similar color And while I'm waiting for the tow truck people and so i can be in the air conditioning and i'll probably see if i can get something to eat too because it's about that time so with that being said yeah see you guys later <sighs> all right guys i am currently in the bathroom because it's potty time for sj but i did want to come over here and kind of give you like an update of what was going on with my car or as much of an update as i can give you so long story short um my engine overheated and the battery light popped up i got my car towed to the dealership and um they know they don't know when they're gonna be able to fix it so i'm gonna get my car towed to another dealership that will be able to fix it on tuesday and yeah that's really it for the car and that's really it for this video so with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this. Don't get up. No, no, don't get up. I'm going to end this video right here for the week. And I will catch up with y'all in my next video. I'm not going to say next week's video because we know I'm not the most consistent. But I will catch up with y'all in my next video whenever that will be. And um, yeah, for now, y'all have a good week. Y'all have a good weekend. Y'all have a good, just have a good day in general. So, uh, yep. SJ wanted. So, so. So, so. SJ had something to say. So, um, yeah, y'all have a good one. And I'll see y'all next time. Peace.